Welcome to the Global Symposium for Regulators 2019 here in Port Vila, Vanuatu, where I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Linda Wade Lamini, who is the uh, Director of uh, Strategy and Economic Regulation uh, for the regulation uh, regulators of uh, the Kingdom of Eswatini. Welcome to the studio. Thank you. Thank now, you. I'd like to start off uh, by uh, talking a little bit about uh, uh, the fact that uh, this year's GSR is all about inclusive connectivity, the future of, of regulation. Uh, how do we achieve inclusive connectivity, in your opinion? Um, like everybody has been saying during this uh, symposium, that uh, connecting the people that are not connected now is going to be slightly difficult than it has been in the past. But uh, I'm encouraged by the different technologies that have been um, displayed and uh, availed, especially in this morning's session, where in now we need to be more innovative in trying to ensure that we cover almost everyone. We are in a good place in my country because we have just now uh, operationalized our universal service and access uh, portfolio and we are really energized and looking at ways of ensuring that we connect the country. What are the major challenges and opportunities that you're, you're facing? Um, challenges of course is being a small country um, and the economy is not very good. We would like to have a very um, big, audacious goals and uh, wishes to connect everyone, but we have limitations as far as resources are concerned. And also, um, our, our major problem is um, ensuring that we have bandwidth. Because we're a landlocked country, we have to depend on other people for um, connecting, so it becomes expensive. So coupled with the fact that our economy is not doing very well and um, all the other issues, we really need to be more innovative than others in ensuring that we achieve uh, inclusive connectivity. So how do you hope to overcome this? Um, what we are doing now is looking at, um, uh, at ways of, of how we can segregate the, the connectiveness in the sense that we are trying to prioritize the areas that we will need to start with and hopefully that our deployment plans are, go are going to be achieved. We are currently looking at um, areas such as schools and also health as a priority. And then we will then take it on, uh, take other areas as well, because we do feel that um, ICTs are the pillar stone for development in every country. And finally, you've uh, taken the time to be here. It's obviously quite a long, long trek from where you are. I just really wanted to find out uh, what you hope uh, to take take away from from this uh, this particular symposium. Um, from symposiums such as this, what we take uh, is take back with us is innovation, because when we sit in our own little corners, we have um, regulations that were enacted when we were established. No, we often find that the legislations that we have need to be revised and reviewed in order for us to be able to accommodate the new technologies that are coming. So right now we are at a point where we need to relook at the regulations that we have in order to ensure that the new technologies that are coming, uh, are, we are able to, to deploy them to ensure connectivity. So coming to GSR is not a waste of time. It's a long way, yes, but I think the benefits are greater. Challenges are, of course, the fact that it becomes expensive to bring um, a big team, whereas I think if we came as a bigger team, we would be we would benefit better. Well, maybe next year it'll be a bit closer to home. But uh, thank you so much for taking the time to be here with us in the studio and at GSR. And hopefully we'll catch up with you again at the next one. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thanks a lot. Thanks.